All right, folks, welcome back to the channel. Is your x -Lite Pro stuck in EU mode after the last firmware update? Well, I've, uh, I've been in contact with somebody at FRSky and they sent me a Lua script to be able to change from EU to FCC. And I'll show you how to do that by using the change ISRM mode Lua script. You can switch from LBT EU to FCC. And just like that, I'm now on FCC, and by the way, this works on D16. Not that it didn't work before, but it, you had to have a LBT receiver. Now this works on a D16 FCC receiver. Uh, the only thing about this is you have to contact at Far Sky Technical Support to get the Lua script. They've they've asked me not to share it because they want to try to narrow down which batch of radios has this issue because not everyone has it. Anyways. I'll put the link to the email address down in the description below. And if for some reason they do say, hey, go ahead and share it, I'll put the link to the, the Lua script down there as well. But go ahead and contact FR Sky, get that Lua script, and I'll show you how to install that and to get this thing fixed and up and running. Uh, one note is this is gonna have to be on a nightly firmware build again. So you're gonna need nightly version 22 or newer of OpenTX 2.3. If you want to know how to install that, check out my video up here on how to install the nightly build. Make sure you're installing nightly 22 or newer. And let's go over to the computer and I'll show you how to get that Lua script onto your radio. All right, after you've received the Lua script from FR Sky Customer Service, go ahead and turn on your x -Lite Pro. Welcome to OpenTX. Acknowledge that yes, this version is not safe to fly because it, you have to have a nightly, nightly version 22 or newer. Go ahead and connect your x -Lite to your computer and select USB storage. And you'll see the internal contents of the Tyrannus. We don't need that. And you have your USB drive. Uh, this is actually the SD card content. So you do need an SD card to make this work. So in here, you're going to find a folder called scripts. Go into scripts and create a new folder called tools. And I believe it has to be in all caps, but uh, I'm not 100% sure. That seemed to work for me. Okay, go into tools. And now we have an empty folder called tools on our SD card. Go into your Lua script that you got from customer service and take the contents of this Lua script folder Go ahead and uh, copy that into that tools folder. And that's it. Go ahead and disconnect your x -Lite Pro. All right, now go ahead and turn your x -Lite Pro back on. Welcome to OpenTX. Yes, acknowledge that it's nightly. Hold the stick to the left to get into your main menu. And we're gonna go over to tools and now you should see change ISRM mode. If for some reason you don't see that, you can go over to your SD card contents, go down to scripts, go down to tools, and long hold on the ISRM mode script and hit execute. And it'll bring you up with this. And you can select FCC or LBTEU. Uh, for me, I need FCC. That's one way to get to it. And then the same thing here, you can do it like that. And just to verify, after you have selected your re region, come down to modules, RX version, and it should be selected either EU or FCC, whichever one it is you need. Now, if this does not work, it's because you have a model loaded up that doesn't use the internal receiver. So you need to make sure that you have the internal receiver selected on whatever, mo whatever model you're on at the time. Uh, if this is on, if this is set to off and you try to run the script, well, the internal module is not actually powered on right now. So, we go over to modules and RX version and see it's empty. It needs to be powered on internally. 
And that's it. And I've confirmed that D16 mode does in fact work. Yes, you're still on a nightly. So all the rules for nightly still exist. Um, please treat it as a nightly, but I'm sure in no time there will be an official release from FR Sky or OpenTX. It kind of made it sound like um, official 2.3 is not too far away. All right, guys, I hope this helped you guys out. Um, please contact uh, FR Sky customer service at the link below. If for some reason they let me share the file, I'll put a link to it down there as well. Uh, if you like what I'm doing here, like, subscribe, hit that bell icon if you want to be notified. If you have any problems or questions, please put them in the comments down below. I check all of them and I try to answer everybody. And if you're uh, interested in anything I have in this video, which is, I don't know, I guess, I guess this thing, go ahead and check out the product link down in the description. Yeah, it's, a, it's an affiliate link. Those do help me out. They do help bring me products from Banggood and other vendors. All right, guys, hopefully this helped. This radio is starting to become an actually a, a, a useful radio. Uh, with a few more tweaks, I think this thing will be really nice. All right, guys, I'll catch you next time.